Apple's insane new partnership with SpaceX. Hello everyone welcome back to our channel Fortune Focus. Everyone knows how Apple is moving forward in technological innovation with all the latest gadgets. However, no one would have expected the company to partner with SpaceX. The collaboration is going to be sensational and we are going to cover all details in today's video. So, keep watching. As Pruda reports, Apple is working on a satellite technology that would seamlessly assist the Internet's functioning. So, no land-based carrier like AT&T or Verizon would be required for the same. The scope of this project is limited for now and only involves a dozen engineers. According to various sources, the overall success of this insane partnership would trace further steps. It seems appealing for an independent company to expand its potential. Now they will be capable of selling phones globally without engaging with local carriers. Users will also not fall behind in reaping its advantages with a list of consumer benefits. There will be the absence of dead zones, roaming, or even 50-page carrier contracts. Moving on, the question comes about the functioning of this whole idea, and it makes us wonder how Apple would turn this vision into reality. It is not feasible for any consumer electronics company to devise rockets or have their own satellites. Thanks to the recently announced plans of Elon Musk to launch more than 40,000 satellites, and it would further help in setting up a space-based communications network called Starlink. Let me bring a little flashback about the whole story here. As per the records, only 9,000 satellites have been launched so far in space history. More than half of them are still present in orbit, and the rest are operational. We can say that the network is partially functioning, as the company launched 60 satellites via a single rocket. In a larger picture, Apple is constantly evolving with time and moving to multiple projects. We do not know if all of them will see the light of day, but it seems fascinating in theory. This time is going to be different and intriguing as Apple and SpaceX come together. Both these companies have direct or indirect connections with their ambitions. So it makes sense to utilize each other's resources and create a robust result. It's apparent what Apple stands to benefit from here. The ability to sell smartphones in a worldwide market with a global connection without dealing with obnoxious agreements and technological limitations imposed by landlocked cellular operators. For its projected mega fleet of satellite systems, SpaceX, on the other hand, requires clients. So the urgency of it can only be accomplished with the appropriate resources and strategy. Both organizations are leaders in their own fields and know the best. Thus, it seems a perfect option to engage and devise a comprehensive solution. Having said that, a variety of uncertainties have also plagued the overall nature of this collaboration. There are contradicting statements and data about the lucrativeness of SpaceX, for instance. The company president, Wynne Shotwell, stated the organization is profitable. And the data from the Wall Street Journal shows a different picture as SpaceX earned a meager profit. It would translate into a mere zero 0.2% if we got serious about the numbers. SpaceX requires a multi-billion dollar payout and direct line of sight if it is to deploy hundreds or thousands of satellites at once, all costing massive amounts of money. This is exactly how Apple comes into the picture with a cash hoard valued at $225.4 million. One company has monetary resources, and the other one has the required technology. So, there is no problem in the whole scenario. This hardly implies that Apple and SpaceX have devised a concrete strategy to destroy the global network business. Suppose Apple intends to give customers Earth-to-space wireless communication without using terrestrial carriers. In that case, SpaceX is the only company globally that has proved both the desire and capacity to do so. The Starlink Network's early days demonstrate this. Apple's riches might fuel it. Overall, it would be intimidating to see how the entire process is carried out in practicality. Besides that, Apple is also moving ahead in another space innovation. Apple Watch Series 6, iPhone 12 Pro, and iPad Mini are scheduled to play a key role in a SpaceX project that will launch an all-civilian team into space, with the named devices being used in various health investigations to see how to how spaceflight affects the human body. So, the team will perform various experiments in the overall health and performance during the mission. 
it is planned at a 575 km orbit, away from any human-occupied spaceflight, since the time the Hubble Space Telescope got its repair. Besides that, the firm is also partnering with the Translational Research Institute for further information about space health. Several investigators at Weill Cornell Medicine will play an integral part in the same. They will further collect more information about the environmental or biomedical data, and biomedical data also forms an integral part of the same. So, it seems fascinating how both the companies are utilizing each other's potential with different projects. The day will not be far when the aerospace and automobile industry partnership becomes a reality of the world. After all, it begins with a single step and actions do matter. What is your viewpoint about Apple and SpaceX coming together? Let us know in the comments section below and do not forget to subscribe to our channel. Bye guys, thanks for watching.